does. Oh, Mrs. McCracken! <laughs> mwah, mwah. <laughs> but I haven't seen you since that benefit to buy fur coats for hairless chihuahuas. Yes, yeah, such a worthy cause. <laughs> they still shook. Oh, what's this? Oh, just a penny I bought. <laughs> wow, daring. Mm. I love the way it explodes on the canvas. It evokes the enigmatic glory of the human condition. Who painted this? Uh, he's no one. Oh, an unknown genius. Mm. How much did you pay? Twenty. Twenty thousand? I'll give you thirty thousand. Thirty thousand? Oh, come on now. A ten thousand dollar profit is nothing to sneeze at. <gasps> Salt! <laughs> yes! And I'll buy any more you can get. Kicking and a scream and So, how are things going with you? Well, everything was going great until they opened that Tata's next door. But the district manager got paralyzed from bad shellfish. Guess who's next in line? I think I'm getting a little bored. Guess who stopped by yesterday? Who? Mrs. Silverman and her son. He was with his beautiful pregnant wife. Is that so? You don't really have a beautiful pregnant wife. Nope, sure don't. You don't even have a bastard child with an ugly woman out of wedlock. Mom. We saw that horrible news story. You are a bunch of gutless sheep. You don't know anything. All right, right, right. Relax, relax, relax. relax. We understand. No, you don't Our understand. Our neighbors, for God's bah. sake, stood on ice blocks. Bah. You want to stop doing that, please? We're requesting additional units from the South Division to help out. Yeah, well, That's why all we... didn't you have them here before? No, Gloria, it's not well, his shut fault. Shut up, Roy. Sorry. Do you have a conscience? What do you mean, of course he's got a conscience. You pull out a gun on one of them, you're going to get killed. Leave this to us. <laughs> Spoken like a true sheep, huh? Well, Gloria. <laughs> shut up, Roy. Sorry. There is something wrong when police start arresting law-abiding citizens. Shall we? The first up is Mr. Phineas T. Swenson's Sun Deck Aviary. Is the owner of the adjacent property present? Right here. Okay. Uh, do you want this uh, 14th day of October agree to? Yeah, him? sure, whatever. I agree. Let's move it along. Well yeah, then. Uh, all in favor? Aye. 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 Motion carries. Will the secretary please affix the wax seal of approval to Mr. Swenson's proposal? Oh, and will the secretary please remember this time that the wax is very hot? Now, next up is Ms. Brown's room addition. Is the owner of the adjacent property present? <laughs> well, I'm afraid if the owner isn't present... No, wait, he's here. Go on, speak up. I just rent the place. <laughs> anyway, I approve her room, if it means anything. It doesn't. And since the owner isn't present, we'll have to table our decision until our meeting next spring. I can't wait until spring. I got a huge hole on the side of my house. Well, I'm sorry, Miss Brown, but there's nothing we can do. There's got to be something you can do. Well, we could levy a hefty fine for starting construction illegally. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Motion carries. 